Notre Dame does football, but this will be the first standalone concert in the stadium's 88-year history. You only get one time to make a first impression, and this is ours, and, and we just happen to be doing the Super Bowl concerts. One big difference, 9,000 people are going to be on the stadium floor, which they began covering Saturday night after the game. And it gets laid one uh, piece after another, wall to wall. We did all four walls of the, uh, of the field, every square inch, all 96,000 square feet has been covered to protect it because uh, we have to play football games after this. Right now, they are working on stage construction and hope to begin focusing on lighting and production on Wednesday. How's the sound and, and how does it get distributed throughout the facility? And since it's the first time in this facility, there'll be a lot of testing of that over Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, to make sure that by Saturday night, it's exactly how Garth and his, his band want, wants it to sound. And Seaman says this wouldn't be possible without all of the dedicated workers. But I, I would literally say it's been thousands of people already and we're only on Tuesday. And that's only gonna increase on Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And on Saturday night, after everything is done, the crew will realize they were a part of history. That'll be a moment where there'll be a handful of us who will just look at each other and say, wow, wasn't that cool? That was a moment. That was history. And then we'll start looking forward to the future.